What's going on guys, Megasmith here, and today we are going to be playing another League Ranked game. This time we are Renekton top lane versus a Garen top lane. Of course, of course. I thought I was going to be going against this Cho'Goth here, but uh, maybe he didn't even want to face me. So he... Uh, didn't want to come top I just missed that creep completely our cooldown should come up by the time he wants to do anything again anyway so that's okay gonna try and uh, get this creep get him a little bit here start healing up trading back and forth whenever possible the only way I can see this happening is if uh, we heal up and don't let him heal up with his passive we're gonna have to start spending our rage on our empowered cues auto attacking here whenever possible I almost feel like flashing in here but uh... I definitely know I don't need to That was a shitty creep to miss. He's going to be able to heal up here a little bit more than I am just because of the way uh, I pushed in. I don't have a trinket, apparently. Something that, uh, you know, you should probably just pick up before, you know, you even walk the lane. But, uh, I guess I, uh, missed that. What do we have as a jungler? We have a Sejuani who probably going to have a hard enough time clearing her own jungle, so mm, I don't like how aggressive he's going in here. Yeah, something's not right about that. I uh can't even ward, so Yeah, we'll just flash out of there because there's no reason in uh, dealing with all that extra CC. I could have potentially killed Garen, um, but I'm not gonna dick around with that. Don't want to set him ahead because uh, the only time I'll be able to kill him is early, and that time is pretty much already passed. Their whole team is gonna be tanky, so. My plan of attack here is pretty much to buy Brutalizer, buy mm, buy this Brutalizer and then from there we will like sort of adapt because that's that's the best thing that we're gonna have because most likely Kennen is going to buy Azonia is most likely Garen's gonna buy Tanky um, I don't think we need to TP in here we can save that for another time Sejuani of course is gonna buy Tanky and the only person who most likely won't is uh, Callista so buying a um, Brutalizer being able to turn that into whatever we want because maybe we'll uh, turn it into a uh, uh, actually I don't know if that would ever be worth it I in this position at least Yeah, he does too much damage for me to, to fight him anymore like that. So, we will just back here and finish this Brutalizer, and then from that we'll go into our Sunfire. Probably the best thing for us to do. Uh, oh yeah, and uh, probably pick up this Ward. 
Yeah, we can't really. I mean, he's going to keep it there anyway, so we might as well just walk back to lane. Uh, I'll slow push it back out. Then can't do anything bot lane because they're also pushed in, even though that would be really nice for me to just get in on. I almost TP'd there. I wasn't sure if he would commit or not. Okay. I mean, he's pretty far up the lane here. If he does that again, I'll uh, go in on him. And then we'll just uh, pop our potions here because that was... A pretty big mistake on our part, I guess. I kind of, I should have at least kited his, uh, his damage there. I'm gonna pop another potion here and try and get all these creep. Of course, I missed the cannon. What would be, uh, what else would be new? This guy's going to be able to out sustain me and uh, be a big bully. So I'm going to walk over here just to make sure that uh, we're not going to be getting ganked. And uh, yeah, I mean, I don't, I really don't think that we can do anything else here other than uh, e even if we got a gank. Uh, we probably couldn't be able to, or we wouldn't be able to kill him together. His ult, I should have probably, uh, looked that up, but, uh, I don't know what a time, or what the timer is on it. The fact that, uh, I was able to slide away from his W there after he silenced me was a little bit weird. <clears throat> make him waste his silence there on the large creep I don't know where Sej oh, Sejuani is in the mid lane so what do we have here for If I had uh, not been in the tower range, I would have been fine, but that was my bad. He has ult. And is she dead? Nice. Pretty good for us. I think Garen ran down to, uh, to bot lane there, but... We'll still be pretty pretty all set here. I'm gonna level up my E again. Yeah. Alright, that was a pretty good TP, even though I didn't get exactly out what I wanted. I think that uh, Garen will most likely want to teleport top lane and I'll just try and slow push this out, even though my lane is yeah, my lane is pushing in, so that's not gonna happen. Uh, I should have bought boots. I'm not sure if I had the money for that or not, but um, yeah, we're in a pretty weird position here because Garen just does uh, does certain things just better than us. Uh, I guess that's a combo that I can use on him. Uh, slide in there once and then slide out. Mm, I'm not sure if the silence affects whether or not uh, I can slide back out or not. Yeah, I can't slide out now. Or 
the silence stop me? Because I was... Oh, maybe I just didn't hit anything on the way in, I guess. Yeah. <sighs> okay, so I fucked that up, basically. <laughs> the easiest way to put it. Uh, if I had stayed... Uh, well, first of all, if I had ulted as I went in there... We would have killed him because we would have had the damage from. We would have had the damage from our ultimate. It would have been. Oh, do we not get AD? I thought you got AD. Maybe I'm just mistaken here, or I didn't notice the uh, stat. Two hundred health. Yeah. Okay. So you don't get AD. Let's just walk away from him. He does have boots, so... And he has a, a Brutalizer himself, which I guess kind of makes sense, but everyone else will most likely just be building... Um, well, they're building a lot of health. So, I think that... Uh, oh, yeah, that's right. That doesn't build... Oh, this does, though. Okay. This builds into a Sunfire, so we, we still have this item going for us. Luckily, I didn't buy the Giant's Belt then, because that's that's the only reason why I have it set up like this. Here, let's look at what they have recommended for rec uh, for Renekton. So, I usually do um, Tiamat as well, but I just figure that we're not going to need the damage. We're more going to need the tankiness, just because of the way that their team is going to be structured. Uh, the damage will be building won't even be that good anyway don't want him to be able to use that silence on me for no reason now I can slowly push this out even though my sunfire is going to be activated here so that's gonna be shitty for us how much ah, we're six and six still but I'm not sure what just happened there. Hmm. I'm just gonna back here to these uh, scuttle crabs. And what is this Cho'Gath doing? Maybe we can just walk into him. Especially since there is a pink ward in this bush oh he got me ah uh, well I can still teleport top lane here And, oh, that was a nice stun there. If only I was able to do anything here. I'm going to go in and uh, try and get my rage up here. So that I can heal up off of some of these champions, maybe. Garen is most likely going to get that um, tower anyway, so I'm not worried about that. I would much, much rather siege this turret. And I'm going to walk to try and avoid any CC here. Alright, so we can't cut off Kennen. I'm gonna go I'm gonna go back and TP top. That's what I thought you would do. Wow. Triple kill down bottom here. I'm gonna actually just go on to the do we have enough? We don't. Oh, shit. I should have just stayed on Cho'Gath then. Is the red buff gonna... Nope. The red buff wasn't enough. How sad. Anyway. We'll TP top here. And uh, push that out. We're gonna buy our Sunfire. Well, what did we need to do there? Probably... Well, first of all, boots would have been nice, right? And then after that, 
I guess the the peeling for well now we don't need to TP top since Udi is there. Might as well go help out the uh, by lane. I don't know. What do we do? Oh, is he just gonna actually commit or? Huh. Wow. There's a uh, four man gank going on here. I just want to make sure that they don't want to engage here. I mean, my ult will be up again soon anyway, but that sucks that, uh, That was actually pretty bad. The uh, I didn't realize that the tower was so low. Um, that set them up pretty nicely there. And even if I had like stunned the Cho'Goth, he he still would have been able to get out of there. So that was my thinking behind that. Um, mm -hmm. What can we build to sort of? negate all of their health I mean nothing right we could like potentially buy blade of the ruined king for um hmm. that's a good job by Udyr then uh, I guess we could potentially buy blade of the ruined king for the percent health damage but Oh, well, we didn't need to do that. Hmm. Hmm. Just, just barely out of that, and then he had to flash. Which, I mean, isn't the best. We could have played that much better. I could have, uh, when I flashed here, I could have E'd twice, then flashed. But maybe they wouldn't have committed to that fight. Uh, our bot lane is actually going to secure us Dragon, which probably is a little bit of a risky play. Uh, I'm not sure how these teams are sneaking by these Dragons. Like, they, we get, we get m the majority of them, but then, like, they end up with, like, one or two at the end of the game. I, 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 you know, it doesn't help that I'm top lane and mid lane usually as well. Um, but being able to watch what's going in the, uh, or going on in the dragon pit with some wardage could help us out a little bit. Anyway, we should be getting a tower here or not. I'm going to start sliding down to, uh, yeah, they're dead. So let's walk to the mid lane and actually let's walk top after we clear mid lane once. Just so that we have uh Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Okay. Yeah, definitely don't want to walk on that. And oh yeah, that was that was bound to happen since she uh, as soon as, as soon as she saw Sejuani and Kennen together, it should have been easy to tell that like what was going to be going on there. definitely gonna want to well first of all not get that much damage on these guys
Trying to protect uh, Caitlyn here. Trying to get our empowered cues off as much as possible as well. I think that, uh... Yeah. That... Okay. Yes, yes. Udyr's most likely going to be able to intercept here. With his bear. Boom. Got her. Alright. So, so we're in a pretty okay position here. Our team on kills is even. We're head and dragons. We're doing a pretty good job of grouping together. And... Uh-oh. Is that going to be enough? Probably not. I'm going to walk down here. Sliding along the way. Clearing out the mid lane. Because by the time anything ends up happening anyways. I'm going to be needed to... Or the creeps are going to be more needed than my body. So I'm going to use these creep for... A little bit of protection here. Uh, oh, Kennen, that's why. Her th uh, thing ended up on me. Now, I'm going to back up here because if Sejuani lands CC on anyone, they're going to uh, they're gonna end up dying. So, let's also walk down to Udyr here. And he probably didn't see that the the whole rest of the team was also following behind him. Or behind Sejuani. Okay. So even though Alistar wasted his uh ulti there, it's alright. We'll back up here and uh, try and get this uh, turret. Unfortunately, he walked a little bit too close there. And then the turret aggroed Caitlyn, so... Alright. Alistar might be dead. I don't know. Um, we will just walk away ourselves. No reason to give the... Give them that, uh... The gold on us. And then we'll walk up and to the left here because... Cho'Goth is gonna show up as well. I think that the very next thing to do would be to go mid lane here because that's a lot of creep that I and I've been missing a lot because I haven't been going top because Udyr has been taking it been helping out the team though so no reason to complain there we go there's something All right, I'm gonna be able to take down the their whole team basically here. If I can get a and well, I'm not. But uh, if I could have gotten a flash E on somebody and stunned them, we could have picked off another person. But uh, we'll just never mind. I don't know if this is uh, warded or not. Okay, so we're going to be able to help out here. Oh, Jesus. Lavished. 
So Cho'Goth, I don't know why he's on me, but uh, I'm going to try and walk up to Anivia here and help out, which I didn't, but oh, is she going to be able to live? I'm not sure if she just didn't have the mana or what. I wasn't looking. Oh, no. It, it looks like she had mana. Anyway, we probably would have survived that if I had backed and bought items. Um, mm. Oh, look at that. Uh, look at that down bottom. What does he have? Wow. He's pretty well off here. Now, I think buying a war mog might be good. What are they? She has percent health damage, doesn't she? And Cho'Goth also eats you, so I'm gonna buy a War Mogs. Uh, no, I'll buy the Randoins first for the the appeal for the teammates, and then then buy the War Mogs most likely. Um. Yeah, I definitely think that uh. Well, first of all, I don't need to be going to the top lane here. But, yeah, I don't need to be going top lane, so I'm going to go to to mid and start clearing. Okay, maybe I can't. They, uh, they all just showed up here. Kennen is not that far ahead, but uh, he can still, if he does, land anything on us. It would be pretty bad. Okay. Now. What is our ping at? 93. Like normal. Can we Baron? Literally, yes. Should we? I don't know. Uh... Okay, so because we're so tanky, we're able to basically lead them to where we want. And luckily, the team committed to getting the Baron. I think that was the better play anyway. And uh, we're going to have to back out here if we can. Ah, oh, that Alistar knocked him. He knocked him in, in the way that I thought he wouldn't. Um, I mean... Obviously, uh, Alistar didn't do that on purpose, so I'm okay with that, but nice job, guys. Okay, so I'm going to finish our Randoins here, which actually would have helped out a lot during that fight. I think that since they're building so much health here, the best thing for us to do for this item is, well, first of all, yeah okay so it is good that we have this but I think the best thing for us to build now mm, actually I don't know I'm gonna well first of all I'm gonna teleport down here to get all this creep and then from here I guess we could walk up to mid lane eh, I don't know they should be able to handle it. I don't know if Caitlyn has a red buff or not, but that would be really nice in order to for her to peel for a uh, peel for herself and kite. Uh, our mid laner isn't there, so but neither is uh, their Kennen, who I didn't even notice was top lane. So. Looks like he's just going to continue farming, which is all right on us. I'm going to move my Randoins around. Sejuani most likely would have been able to kill me there, but I think she wanted to back off here so that she could go... Oh, she doesn't. She wanted to... Either she was scared or I don't know, but we're going to go help our team secure this tower.
make sure that uh oh i already used random ones i just pressed one again um here we go We're gonna get this, and I'm gonna definitely walk down here, and or not. We should be able to get these towers, actually. Hmm. So you have to press it faster than that, man. The number one thing I've I've heard about Alistar's uh, WQ is that to treat it like a horse galloping, basically. Uh, and that's the end of the game. Uh, so yeah, so the horse galloping, so it's like WQ. It's like right away. It's bop, 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 bop. Um, anyway, what happened in that game? Top lane was a farm lane. Uh, I could have killed him. I made a couple of mistakes where I could have killed him. Uh, and gotten the money. Bot lane, I don't remember anything that happened there. I did go I did go bot and I teleported around quite a bit to try and uh to try and help out the team. Anivia was doing alright. Um I think I think the person who carried the most this game was Udir. Because e even even I, I was doing okay. I just wasn't going to be able to do anything, especially in the late game. Anyway, if you guys enjoyed the video please rate and share the video it would really help me out if you want to see more league i put videos up every day so you could subscribe to the channel to see that until next time though okay bye